Set up NordVPN on PFSense router This is a tutorial on how to set up an open VPN connection to NordVPN from your PFSense router. PFSense version 2.2.31. Download the latest CA certificates from https www.nord.com slash api slash static slash ca underscore n underscore tls underscore auth underscore certificates dot zip and extract the package. 2. Open the PFSense web UI and go to System Cert Manager. 3. In the Cotab fill in, descriptive name, name it NordVPN, method, choose import an existing certificate authority, certificate data, this is the CA certificate of the South African server, if you wish to set up other server, you need to use that server certificate accordingly begin certificate example and certificate certificate private key, leave blank, serial for next certificate, leave blank, click save. 4. Now go to VPN and select open VPN from the drop down menu. 5. General. Information select client tab and enter the configuration as listed below, disable this client, leave unchecked. Server mode, peer to peer, SSL slash TLS, protocol, UDP, you can also use TCP, device mode, ton, interface, 1, local port, leave blank, server host or address, za1.nordvpn.com. Server port, 1194, proxy host or address, leave blank, proxy port, leave blank, proxy authentication extra options, authentication method, none, server host name resolution, check infinitely resolve server, description, any name you like. In our case it was NordVPN. User authentication settings username slash pass, your NordVPN username slash your NordVPN password. Cryptographic settings TLS authentication, remember, it is for the example above begin open VPN static key v1 example end open VPN static key v1 peer certificate authority, NordVPN, client certificate, web configurator default, 557 to 1 to 2 and 90 C7, asterisk in use, please note that the numbers on your machine could be different, encryption algorithm, ease 256 CBC, 256 bit, auth digest algorithm, SHA1, 160 bit, hardware crypto, no hardware crypto acceleration. Tunnel settings IPv4 tunnel network, leave blank, IPv6 tunnel network, leave blank, IPv4 remote network slash S, leave blank, IPv6 remote network slash S, leave blank, limit outgoing bandwidth, leave blank, compression, enabled with adaptive compression, type of service, leave unchanged eat, disable IPv6, check don't forward IPv6 traffic, don't pull routes, check this option effectively bars the server from adding routes to the client's routing table, however note that this option still allows the server to set the TCP slash IP properties of the client's ton, tap interface, don't add slash remove routes, leave unchecked, advanced configurations advanced, leave blank, verbosity level, 3, recommended, click save, 6, go to interface and select assign drop the drop down list, then click on the end button, a new interface will be created, name it nord underscore za for instance, also, change the interface port to open x where x is the number of the interface you have created, usually it will be 1, save changes, 7, now go to firewall nat outbound, for the outbound rule mode select hybrid outbound nat rule generation, automatic outbound nat end rules below, you will now need to copy mappings listed and change interface to nord underscore za, or whatever other name you have used in the previous step. You should now see something like in the picture below. The last step is to configure firewall rules. Go to firewall rules LAN. Create a new rule. The settings should be, action, pass, disabled, leave unchecked, interface, LAN, TCP slash IP version, IPv4, protocol, any, source, type, any, destination, any, log, leave unchanged eat, description, name it whatever you like, Advanced features in the advanced features you only need to change one setting, gateway, type, interface that we have created, in our case it is Nord underscore ZA. Click save and then apply the changes to the firewall settings. Done PFSense version 2.3.21. In order to set up PFSense 2.3.2 with OpenVPN please access your PFSense via browser. Then navigate to System Certificate Manager Ka. You should see the screen, too we will configure our PFSense to connect to DK3 server. Press on plus add button. Then fill the fields out like this, desk deprive name. NordVPN underscore DK3 underscore cert method, import an existing certificate authority certificate data, you can get this certificate by downloading NordVPN CA and TLS files from here, https slash slash nord.com slash api slash static slash CA underscore and underscore TLS underscore auth underscore certificates dot zip, begin certificate example and certificate press save you should see something like this, 3. Then navigate to VPN open VPN clients and press plus add 4. Fill in the fields, disable this client, leave unchecked. Server mode, peer to peer, SSL slash TLS, protocol, UDP, you can also use TCP, device mode, ton, interface, 1, local port, leave blank, server host or address, dk3.nordvpn.com, server port, 1194, proxy host or address, leave blank, proxy port, leave blank, proxy authentication extra options, authentication method, none, server host name resolution, check infinitely resolve server, description, any name you like, in our case it was NordVPN DK3 user authentication settings, username slash pass, 
your NordVPN username slash your NordVPN password. Cryptographic settings, TLS authentication, check automatically generate a shared TLS authentication key, uncheck then type in TLS key of DK3 server which can be found here, HTTPS slash slash Nord.com slash API slash static slash CA underscore N underscore TLS underscore auth underscore certificates dot zip. Begin open VPN static key v1 dash 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 example and open VPN static key v1 dash 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 peer certificate authority, NordVPN underscore DK3 underscore cert, client certificate, web configurator default, 557 to 102 and 90 C7, server, yes, in use, please note that the numbers on your machine could be different, encryption algorithm, East 256 CBC, 256 bit, auth digest algorithm, SHA1, 160 bit, hardware crypto, no hardware crypto acceleration. Tunnel settings, IPv4 tunnel network, Lee blank, IPv6 tunnel network, Lee blank, IPv4 remote network slash S, Lee blank, IPv6 remote network slash S, Lee blank, limit outgoing bandwidth, Lee blank, compression, enabled with adaptive compression, type of service, leave unchanged eat, disable IPv6, check don't forward IPv6 traffic, don't pull routes, check, don't add slash remove routes, leave unchecked. Advanced configurations, custom options, Lee blank, verbosity level, 3, recommended, click save. 5. Navigate to interfaces interface assignments and add NordVPN DK3 interface. 6. Press on the OPT1 to the left of your assigned interface and fill in the following information, enable, check description, NordVPN IPv4 configuration type, DHCP IPv6 configuration type, none MAC address, leave blank MTU, leave blank MSS, leave blank do not change anything else. Just scroll down to the bottom and press save 7. Navigate to services DNS resolver general settings enable, check listen port, leave what it already is network interfaces, all outgoing network interfaces, NordVPN system domains local zone type, transparent DNSEC, uncheck DNS query forwarding, check DHCP registration, check static DHCP, check save. 8. While in DNS resolver, select advanced setting at the top and then fill in the following, hide identity, check hide version, check prefetch support, check prefetch DNS key support, check save. 9. Navigate to firewall NAT outbound and select hybrid outbound NAT rule generation. Press save. Then click on bottom add and fill in the fields, disabled, Uncheck do not NAT, uncheck interface, open VPN protocol, any source, network, 127.0.0.0 slash 8, port, leave blank destination, any, grayed out, port, 500, static port, check description, ISIC, land to NordVPN save. Now you need to create three more rules with these settings, disabled, uncheck do not NAT, uncheck interface, open VPN protocol, any source, network, 127.0.0.0 slash 8, port, leave blank destination, any, grayed out, port, leave blank static port, uncheck description, localhost to NordVPN save. Disabled, uncheck do not NAT, uncheck interface, open VPN protocol, any source, network, 192.168.10.0 slash 24, port, leave blank destination, any, grayed out, port, 500, static port, check description, ISIC, LAN to NordVPN save. Disabled, uncheck do not NAT, uncheck interface, open VPN protocol, any source, network, 192.168.10.0 slash 24 Blank destination, any, grayed out, port, leave blank static port, uncheck description, localhost to NordVPN save. At the end it should look like this, 10. Navigate to firewall rules LAN and add this rule at the top by click on top add button, action, pass disabled, uncheck interface, LAN address family, IPv4 protocol, any source, invert, uncheck, any, blank click on show advanced and fill in the single field, gateway, Nord underscore DHCP. Save. At the end it should look like this, 11. Go to System General Setup and fill in, DNS Server 1, 162.242.211.137, None DNS Server 2, 78.46.223.24, Nord underscore DHCP. Save. 12. Now you can navigate to Status Open VPN and it should state that the service is up. 13. You can also check the connection log file under Status System Logs Open VPN, done.